All right, guys, so we're out just exploring around Ohio today. Thought we'd take you guys with us. And we're going to go, where did you say we were going to go? Darby Creek uh, Park. Darby Creek Park. Yep. Why? Because there's bison there. Bison. Or near there or something. Anyway, we're going to go look for some buffalo. I like the Indians, the buffalo. But uh, first things first, we're going to stop and get a donut because we are right by the best donuts in Columbus, the Jolly Pirate. So let's go get a donut. And I'm fat and I like donuts. <laughs> <laughs> In our travels all the way across the country, we could never find donuts that actually had cream filling. Now, we're back to the place, the right place on earth. They have cream filling in the middle of their long johns. We are over here at the Darby Metro Creek Metro Park Nature Center here. This is actually located in Darby, Ohio which is just west of Columbus, Ohio. So let's make a walk around and take a look. Some interesting things here. Raccoon with a fish. Smile, you're on camera. Literally. <laughs> yeah, this might not be. And yeah, this may be a little much for people who don't like taxidermy. But here's a gray wolf. Yeah. yeah, I don't really see the allure of that, but uh, okay. Some more pelts. There's a coyote. A gray fox. A red fox. Uh, there's a bobcat. Northern Raccoon, Virginia Possum, Groundhog, which you might have got what you deserve considering you saw your shadow going to be six more weeks of winter now. <laughs> Sorry. And a muskrat. Anybody like beaver? black bear. It looks a little brown. Here's a big old bison skull. And hide here. This guy's got a massive skull. These horns. There's my hand. And you got small hands anyway. It doesn't really matter. <laughs> Not sure how good the audio is going to be here, but we found some bison horns.
very big majestic creatures. They taste pretty good too, especially in cheeseburger burger form. Wish we could get a little closer to these guys. But not really no way in down there. And I'm too old to be jumping at this push. Very nice little sanctuary here in Ohio. Park systems have made for these poor guys here. And it is extremely cold out here, guys. And the wind, it's making it almost unbearable to try to get out here and do any filming outdoors here. But, great. As I said, they have some activities and stuff here for kids. A little learning center. Good job, Ohio. Nice little play area. And just out the door over there is the actual view of some bison. It's a fun little adventure in there. Getting to know some things about Darby Creek that I didn't know. And I grew up out this way. This facility here is actually new. So, now check it out. All these guys here still enjoy the cold and swimming. Me, not so much. I look like this. Miss Jill's not quite prepared <laughs> for as cold as it is. As you see, <laughs> I've done put a uh, heavier coat on and I've got my oh. hood on. Wait, wait. Oh, wait, that's the wrong thing. Hold on, hold on. I got it. See what I deal with? <laughs> ah. Is that better? No. Okay. <laughs> Is that's better. <laughs> that's better. Can you see I where look, we're going? I look better now. <laughs> so, yeah, we're uh, still here exploring Metro Darby Creek uh, oh. recreation areas and parks. <clears throat> and so we're taking a nice little walk down the trail here. Probably shouldn't have took this walk. It is it's a little brisk. <laughs> it's really brisk. Um, but a hair static. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. We've just yeah, we've just been cooped up way too long we just had to get out today guys and just kind of walk around i mean this was actually what about an hour from where we were we are because we're on the other side of uh oh, we're on the extreme <laughs> east part of columbus and we are on the extreme west part of columbus now so but yeah it's still i used to come to this park as a kid uh and we used to walk these trails ride our bikes and all kind of stuff like that back when we were little kids uh get to go off trail things you weren't supposed to do get in mischief and kind of trace around through the woods it was fun let me see here we're gonna try to pan around behind us hopefully this wind's not too strong as you guys can see this is little darby creek here i don't know why they call it exactly little darby creek it's got some deep spots and stuff in it i so. think uh, one of those things was talking about part of it is Big Darby Creek and part of it's Little Darby Creek and they come together. Okay, maybe that's here. what it is. I'm getting old. I don't remember that kind of stuff. I just read it. Oh, the reason okay. <laughs> well, that explains a lot. Yeah, she just got a updated version of what's really going on out here, not me. I wouldn't have done it if I didn't read it. <laughs> However, one good thing about coming to these kind of places this time of year, it's not super busy. You can kind of walk around, explore. Wait, wait, it is busy. Did you show them? Did I show them what? It's very busy. Oh. <laughs> we got some wildlife out there in the creek. It's 50 geese. However, there's another person walking up there. You think we're crazy? Probably. Who cares? Well, we can't be no crazier than they are. They're out here walking around. They ain't got as much clothes on as we do. So. My mommy had me tested. Your mommy had you tested? You're not crazy? <laughs> no, I am crazy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not so. sold as... <laughs> So anyway, yeah, we're probably going to go ahead and wrap this up and find ourselves someplace warm. So I want to say thanks for watching today, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the buffalo and bison over there. 
at the Nature Center. And we'll talk to you guys soon. Remember, remember to like us still on Facebook, Instagram, and don't forget to come over and check us out at rollingwithabones.com. We'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.